Hey guys, Pie Guy Rules here, and I am with me, Aaron, my girlfriend artist, um, and we're here to vote on the Kids Choice Awards. Now, fair warning, this one isn't blind. Uh, there was a failed recording of this. This, this stupid program didn't work right, so oh. we're doing it again. There wasn't really spoilers. There wasn't really anything like outrageous that needed a first impression. Oh yeah, this winners are determined by voter preference and other considerations. What is that supposed to mean? Yeah, that is so rude. someone tweeted that to me, and you know I've never been. If you look if you look back at these videos, I've never been in the camp. Everyone's always like, oh, the videos, the Kids Choice Awards are rigged. SpongeBob wins every year, and I've never been in that camp because. It doesn't really make any sense why they would rig this. I mean, it's not like you were going to go watch a show, but then you were like, Oh, no, this show came in second at the Kids' Choice Awards. Excuse me, I will pass on Spongebob. <laughs> um, you know, there was no real reason to, but seeing that, you know, I kind of wonder. I mean, I don't know. Uh, awards shows are kind of nonsense in general, so. Anyway, favorite kids' TV show. Okay, so. Well, I've seen all of these. <sighs> Um, yeah, I haven't seen any of these. I've seen part of Doug with a blog before deciding it was too stupid for me to even review. Um, and now that I said that, everyone's going to ask me to review it. Uh, <laughs> Henry Danger is on my hit list, so at some point soon. I've heard bad things about Nikki, Ricky, Dicky, and Dawn. Um, so ha Nikki, Dicky, or Nikki, Ricky, Dicky, and Dawn? Yes. That's yes. That's really dumb sounding. <laughs> so I don't know how to pick this one. Should uh, uh when did I go with the first one? <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, I guess. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not. I can't. I don't have an informed opinion. Can I? Uh, can I just like recuse myself from this one? No. <laughs> All right. You have um, to answer. I have to answer it. All right. Fine. I'll, I'll go with Henry Danger because, I mean, it's. Everyone tells me it's bad, but like. I don't know, you know, because it'll be ironic when I hate the show later on. Yeah. There we go. All right, voting for irony. Okay, favorite family TV show. At least they identified it as family TV shows, but I'm I wonder why. Like, Gotham? Why are why are why these is even Gotham here? A... Family. I mean, like even for family shows, they could, like Modern Family makes sense, but they could have gone with a lot more uh, safer things. Um, again, I haven't. I've seen Ages of Shield. I saw the first few episodes. I. I don't like Modern Family, and I don't like the the CW, all of their teen drama uh, superhero shows, and I don't like The Big Bang Theory, so yeah, Ooh. we're going to go Marvel. Um, favorite TV actor? Alright, um, of these shows, I've only seen the middle, and I actually like the middle, so we're going to go with this guy. Though, this is, this is a pretty random selection, I have to say, because... Appa like, look, at the this guy from The Flash. Apparently, like, they focus on very few select shows, and then they just kind of, like, reuse those. Yeah. I don't... I don't know. Um, I mean, is the... the okay. I, I'm gonna go with this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, and you gotta see Probably ads. special video. You gotta see ads that just just tell you to vote, except that one didn't finish. Um, favorite... T see, look, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. It's, they pick, like, six shows, and then that's their pool for, like, everything. Go with Jennifer Morrison. She was on House. Who... Ooh. Who was she? Um... Was she a oh, patient one time? Oh, God. Oh, I love that show, but I don't remember her name. Was she one of the first... She was what, uh, one... One of House's first... She was, like, the initial the, first the, one, lady. The girl, you know? uh, the girl that dated the Australian guy. Yeah. Yeah. Good eye, mate. All right. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, anybody that likes House. I like I House. Suck. Cameron. Huh? Yes, yes. Yeah. That's there. Um... Okay. Yeah, I don't know any of the rest of these people. And I... Of of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., I didn't actually like her. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going with that. Alright, now, you notice that... Definitely Teen Titans Go. You know, shh, The people won't know you're kidding. <laughs> They'll think I'm dating someone with bad tastes. Alright, um... You'll notice that... Uh, that like... This... <laughs> The, the top hat and the... This isn't from he's an episode. Up. He knows he's winning. This is promotional f material that they made just for this. And what's... Like, I can understand why the rest of these don't have that. But, like, Fairly Odd Parents didn't get it either. Um, yeah, uh, this selection is pretty weak. Uh, Gravity Falls. Come on. Gravity Falls. Like, like please. Yeah. Phineas and Ferb, ha like, is not in, in the spotlight anymore. Um... 
I mean, fa- Family Odd Parents has never <laughs> been in the spotlight. It's in well, I guess in a positive way. You know, at least Adventure Time, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and even Teen Titans Go make sense because they're more recent shows. But yeah, um, I would have you know, and even if Adventure Time, this is a bad picture of Finn. I didn't even know the Phineas and Ferb was still going on. Honestly, I think it is. I, I don't. I, I I'm pretty sure it is. But yeah, it's. It's like on its it's it's getting old, but anyway, yeah. Um, no, <laughs> vote for Adventure Time. But yeah, I love how they put that there. Like, I don't. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, Fault in Our Stars. Pick it. Pick, pick, pick it. No. Um, it's so good. I, the movie I was read... kind of cheesy, but the book's so good. I haven't read any of these. Uh, and but like, is it a kids? It would is it a book that you think kids that That's... are voting on this would would have read? The the book about the cancer patient and the Anne Frank Museum and the well the Ma- wasn't isn't Maze Runner pretty gruesome too? Well, Maze Runner movie was terrible, and I think it was also PG thirteen. Yeah, I don't know. Books books shouldn't exist anymore. Um, Where is Harry Potter? I'll go for that one. <laughs> no, they finally got that off the ballot. We, we don't need to. Um, I don't know. Sure. Why would you? Because do- oh, the God. cover amused me. Most addicting game now. They've gotten rid of favorite video game, and it is now most addicting game. That's interesting. So it's kind of like you have to pick Candy Crush, because and it is very Yeah, addicting. like, technically, yes. It's not um, good, but it's... As far as the addicting. selection goes, I mean, Mario Kart 8 makes sense. There is no Smash Bros. I don't actually know if the new Smash Bros. was rated T. I think it's E10. It's the, the case is uh, over there. I'm what is it? it? I'm reaching it. What is it? E for everyone. E. Yeah, Smash Bros. For should, everyone ten and up. Should be on here. You know, Skylanders makes sense. Minecraft makes sense. Although, it, Minecraft is kind of old. Even though it is still relevant, you think they'd pick stuff that actually, like, had some sort of significance in the past year? Like, if anything, Minecraft has been less significant in the past year. Um, But yeah, and like, Angry Birds Transformer. Who even plays Angry Birds anymore? Like... Like, come on, this is this is yeah. stupid. And this is the only, I believe this is the only video game category. They don't even have, like, I think, did they get rid of the app? Yeah, they got Yeah, they got rid of the app. So, like, come on, you can't give us better selections than this. Um, I'm going to go with Mario Kart. I mean, most addicting game is Candy Crush, and that should win. But I'm going to go, actually, no, you know, I'm going to go with Minecraft, because that, to, that, that's what I've been addicted to lately, um, as per usual. Um, favorite blue colored villain? <laughs> uh, just hands down, Meryl Streep. Why does? Uh, just don't you don't have to look at the rest. I don't just... know why, but this guy, I I saw Amon. Like I don't know, just the hood and the. Anyway, who? who, who Meryl who? Streep into the. Woods. Oh no, no, Guardian of the Galaxy, dude. Oh no. I mean, he wasn't like a great villain was... or anything. No, but... but you didn't see her into the woods. No, Meryl Streep was I didn't. so good. I didn't. Uh, I'm sure she was, but. I... Uh, I'm gonna... No, you're the worst. Uh, I know. I'm gonna get comments. Um, favorite me. favorite reality show. Dance Moms. I like Shark Tank, although I I don't know how many kids are interested in like financial stuff. Um, oh gosh. Uh, oh, I don't what, know. This Wipeout just is seems really like, entertaining. This just seems like a really random assortment of reality shows. Like why? Like here's the thing. It should just be about kid-based stuff, like exclusively kid-based stuff, because when you start to go into the world of, like, general entertainment that's for everyone, like, why these six reality shows? You know, there's a million of them out there. If, if you're counting stuff like Survivor to, you know, I, I don't know, to, to Dance Moms and Shark, you know, like, all sorts of different things, there's tons of them. Like, who decided this, you know? I are these maybe these are like what ranked highest amongst kids that would make sense master chef junior at least makes sense um i'm gonna go with shark tank just because that's that's my favorite um favorite talent competition show why do they have this and, and reality, reality yeah, show yeah i i don't know and yet and yet there's only one category unless i'm wrong is there only yeah there's only one category no, sorry, two categories related to cartoons. An animated favorite show and favorite movie. That's it. You know, like, you would think, you would think they do maybe, like, favorite new show and favorite returning show or just something like that. Maybe keep it more, but, like, 
so much of this stuff, I mean, I don't know, but when I was a kid, I, I really couldn't care, I, I, I did not care about these talent competition shows. Granted, I don't think they were as big when we were kids, mm. but, like, I, uh, why? Why focus on this? Alright, I don't know, what do last you, what year, do you... Last year's, the different categories you could pick from last time was better. Yeah, I don't actually remember what it was last year, although we'll be going to that in a second. Um, what do you think, which one? I, uh, I'm neutral. I stopped watching America's Got Talent about three years ago. I stopped watching American Idol like ten years ago. Who watches American Idol anymore is what I, I want to know. know. Who, who are these people? Uh, well, I mean, I know who he is, but... Uh, all right, we're, we're spending the voice, too much time. The long. voice is, like, super popular. Oh, is, that, is Nick Cannon on The Voice? Is that who? No, it's Pharrell. Oh, okay. <laughs> the picture is small, all right? <laughs> Uh, Can't you tell by I, no, the weird hat? You know, I'm gonna pick Dancing with the Stars because the host guy, I don't know who he is, but he looks like the saddest in the picture. Like, all, <laughs> these, all these other people, have, and all, all these people have people, and she looks really confident, and, and you know, like, she's ready. She's he, smizing. He's just like, I'm still relevant. Dance with me. <laughs> like, I miss America's Home video, Funniest Home Videos. Oh, was he? Yeah. Oh, that's Bob Saget. Wow, he's no, looking old. Bob Saget. <laughs> Sarcasm. Anyway, um, if 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 you're new to this Kids Choice Awards video, I you I do these very off the cuff. I I really don't care about this. To be honest, I do this just for fun. Guardians of the Galaxy. You don't even have to look at the rest. Yeah, no, I really Seriously. don't. Well, I should talk about these though. I didn't see Melissa Melissa Fint, Maleficent. Maleficent. It was pretty good. Uh, I didn't see Tim Tim and well, okay. Well, let me put it this way: the only one I saw was Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> Although, I, I, you know, I can know that this was probably terrible. Um, I'm sure Hunger Games was fine. It's not a movie series I watch, but mm -hmm. I'm sure it's fine. Eh. Alright, yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy. Favorite movie actor. Now, here's, the, here's the game where you, try to, where you try to remember what these people were in. Um, Will Arnett was in the Lego movie as Batman. And that's what makes me happy. Um, mm -hmm. Mark Wahlberg was in Transformers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jamie ben... Foxx was in Annie. Oh, was he? Yeah. Oh, the poor guy. <laughs> um, Hugh Jackman is Wolverine, right? Yeah. So, and there was an X Men movie this year, right? Was there? <laughs> yeah, X Men: Days of Future Past of. Right. Oh, okay. I, I think. I'll sure. choose to. Oh, All right, Ben Stiller oh. wasn't he in the movie? The guy that like worked at Time Magazine. The oh, Walter oh, Mitty, yeah. Walter yeah, Schmitty, yeah. whatever. <laughs> um, and Steve Carell was in uh, Anchorman good. 2. <laughs> yes. Which was maybe this past year. Um, I don't uh, know, man. I'm going with Will Arnett. If you, you, I like Will Arnett. He's cool. Favorite movie actress? Oh, no, I don't know. Who, who are... Emma Stone. Emma Stone's the queen of everything. Who, who is she? What did she do? You've never seen it. Oh, she, okay, well, she's I'm not being little... sarcastic, but... Well, she's in a lot of stuff. Uh, okay. She was in Zombieland. She was in the new, the Amazing Spider-Man. She was Gwen mm. Stacy. Are any of these people in any movies I saw or liked? I mean, I know a movie she was in, but uh, let's see. Actually, she. Well, I don't you think didn't she see. Was you didn't see Maleficent, so you don't know Elle Fanning. Angelina Jolie was also in Maleficent. Right, I'm gonna pick Cameron Diaz because her no. picture is the worst. No, no, she was in Annie. <laughs> she, that oh, movie, oh, that movie oh, no. Emma Stone. Her picture does look the worst, though. Not not her, but just like lower. It looks lower quality, like not not as good lighting, I guess. I don't know. Emma. Uh, Emma Stone. All right, fine. Only because I don't you. know. <laughs> Favorite animated movie. Hmm. Oh, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make people mad. Well, I'm gonna make people wet mad with every choice, but <coughs> especially this one, I feel. All right. Penguin well, movie. you know I'm not picking Penguins of Madagascar. Uh, I didn't see Big Hero Six. Didn't really look that interesting to me. Um, didn't see Rio 2, again, didn't look interesting to me, didn't Spongebob see movie. Rio da -da 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 -da. Um, well, see, the here's the thing, um, I really like the Spongebob movie, mm -hmm. uh, you know that. Why are you um, circling your cursor? Because <laughs> it's, it's a mystery which one I'm gonna pick, I mean, I know which one I'm gonna pick. And How to Train Your Dragon 2, uh, I have actually taken a pact to never speak about that movie. <laughs> um, so please do not leave comments telling me to review it or asking me for my opinion. Could you, you review it? You, you don't. Guy guy? You don't want to know. You don't want to know what I think about that movie. The, the world needs to know. I'm gonna pick the Lego Movie. I, I really liked the Lego Movie. I mean, I thought that it was, it was, it worked on so many different levels. There were so many different elements that just all came together to make a fantastic movie. Um, though wasn't the Lego Movie like twenty four? 
I get confused with how they do this because I guess transcends it's, time. It's Who the cares? full. It, it's like the full year. So like some of this stuff is, uh, I don't know. Um, anyway, favorite male action star. Oh my god, Chris Pratt. Mm. Oh yeah. Guardians of the Galaxy. He, wait, he, who, where? Okay, uh, yeah. There yeah. we go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. All right. Well, we'll just who are the rest? This is this is uh, American man. Captain America. <laughs> Captain America. Uh, this is. Uh, Channing Tatum, he, I'm trying, wow, oh, 22 Jump Street, yeah, 22 Jump Street. I didn't see it. Amazing Spider-Man. this Spider is ba this ba Spider Batman. <laughs> Spider Batman. Uh, um. This is Liam Neeson. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and this is, this is, uh, the Hulk. So, <laughs> so we're gonna go, we're gonna go with Howard the Duck over there. Star Wars. Uh, uh, uh favorite female action star. See, like, okay, again, when I was a kid, I, I didn't care about the people behind the movies, to be honest. Yeah. I cared about the characters. Like, and again, I, you know, I don't know. I don't speak for everyone, obviously. But, like, I, I, I you see, I still don't know who these people are because I'm not as concerned. I mean, I, I'm, I'm more concerned about the characters and, and stuff than who actually plays them, which I guess in a way sounds bad. But mm -hmm. in another way, I don't really concern myself with that as much as I concern myself with. Um, you know the actual story. Characters, yeah. yeah. What is? Why is there a check mark against favorite new? Because you, I guess you picked someone. Already. I guess I did. Scarlett Johansson, because all of that action in her. I think her was too. No. Uh, I was. Okay. Um, okay. What was Ellen Page in? Uh. Quickly. I don't. What was, was that, uh, Angelina Jolie in? <laughs> Evangeline Lilly was in The Hobbit. Oh, was she The Hobbit? No. She's, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> what was Haley Berry? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. Oh, she was, was she in Catwoman. She, wasn't she in, was in Catwoman. No, she wasn't in the X Men one. Did no, she, she was she Catwoman. Uh, what was Zoe Deschanel? Soldata was in Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> was she, was she the red? She was the green green lady. <laughs> okay, uh, so we're gonna go with we're gonna go with her, not her, her. You get it? You get it? Ha huh. ha ha! Oh my gosh! All right, favorite, wow. favorite movies. Okay, I actually like Coldplay. It picked it picked a music group I know and actually listen to, and that's amazing because I listen to about three different musicians. Um, <laughs> the other two are Billy Joel and Weird Al. Do you listen to One Direction? No. Um, are you sure? I don't know who. The, well, no, I kind of know. I know who the. I know Maroon Five. One, yeah. Well, it's not even. It's not even a thing. It ain't yeah. no. Ain't no thing but a swang. All right. Um, see, like, look at this. There's three about music and only two about animation. One of the things they got rid of this year was favorite animated uh, voice actor or mm -hmm. voice of an animated movie or whatever, um, which is dumb. I mean, come on. All right, favorite male singer. Who? Sam Smith. Okay, this guy's hosting. Um, I want to vote for Nick Jonah. Well, I want to vote for him only because of the weirdness that it would be that the host got an award. Like, h how does... But uh, uh, J, J, J Tim's J Tim's uh, J Tim's is obviously the best of these guys. Why? What, who are you? You're shaking your head. Sam Smith. Who is Sam Smith? You, Was he on Glee? Get, get out of my face. Is he that kid on Glee? No. He looks no. like the kid on Glee. No. <laughs> no, he. You don't listen to like main radio, so you don't really. No. We should listen to him sometime. Okay. He's not. He's. I don't think he's really someone you'd like, though. Okay. All right. Favorite female singer. I. <laughs> I just I can't get over it. this picture of Katy Perry with the. She's green already hair. slimed. She, yeah, like it's like she did that on. Maybe this is what she wore to the Kids Choice Awards last year. I don't remember. Oh no, she wore something really revealing last year. I I remember actually. I do remember that. <laughs> anyway, um, of course you'd remember that. Let's see. There's, there's, there's Beyonce, uh, Selena Gomez, uh, T Swifties, uh, Shake It Off, uh, Cat. No. Um. <laughs> no. Oh, have any of these people put out a song I can tolerate? Taylor Swift. Okay, well, I actively hate the songs that she, T. Swift puts out. Those are earworm horribleness. Beyonce. Beyonce is classic. What did Beyonce? Awesome. What did Beyonce make last year? She. Listen. She, yeah. she put out like a that, like a brand new album, didn't she? Like a surprise album. <laughs> surprise! It sucks. Uh, I gotta go, with Katy Perry, because I'm not a fan. The same slots and everything. Wow! It's like they spent two minutes programming. Anyway, um. Oh no, these songs. 
Uh, I don't like All About That Bass. No, I don't like any of these songs. Dark Horse is, is probably the least stupid. Yeah, ever. oh god, Shake It Off is gonna win, and I hate that. Fancy, uh, yeah, Dark Horse. Alright, um... Great picks! Thanks! So, so now... <laughs> <laughs> um, before, before I end this video... Well, actually, the, there's a big elephant in the room that I totally forgot to mention straight up. Um, before, before we go, I'm we're gonna talk a little bit about the changes that were made this year. Um, the big elephant in the room is that there's six choices. I don't think there's ever been six choices. I mean, so I could, I like could be, four. yes, it's, I could be wrong on this, maybe like 10, 20 years ago. Um, but in any memory that I have, it's always been four choices. Um, I think it's great that they're doing six. I think it makes sense. Mm -hmm. Although I think considering they always have problems with time on the show, like actually not having time to present awards, <laughs> adding two extra things that they have to announce for everything, um, is probably an issue, um, but all right. Um, so here's last year's, here's what, um, all the stuff that was last year. So, yeah, uh, 2014. So yeah, they had favorite voice of an animated movie. They got rid of that. Um, butt kickers. they got rid of the butt kicker awards, which I thought was pretty cool. Like if you're going to do, if you're going to do these actors, I guess that's like the action. Movie. Yeah. Yeah. It was, they just that's what it was. It. Um, did they have action movie this year? Yeah, they had ac action. That remember when I said, "Oh, Scarlett Johansson, a lot of action in her." Oh, okay. She was like an action star. Okay, all right, makes sense. Makes sense. Um, I think she was actually in that Lucy movie. Oh no! Then that's that's what the actual action oh, thing was. Oh <laughs> no! Well, good thing I didn't. And the Avengers. All right. Anyway. That was a while ago. Anyway, um, yeah, voice of an anime movie, butt kicker, um television favorite tv show is still there uh there was only the one reality show they animal didn't... sidekick oh yeah animal sidekick they got rid of which was good because that was i mean I, that was kind of a clever it, the execution wasn't great but that was kind of a clever idea at least a good way to bring in more animation into it patrick star is an animal sidekick we i went through this last year oh, all right my God. <laughs> we're trying to wrap things up here um music groups uh, yeah, they had app game. They didn't have any game. They, it was just... Oh, no, it was video game and app game. This year, it was most addicting game. It wasn't video, favorite video game. It wasn't favorite app game. It was most addicting. Fan art. Okay, so favorite funny star that they got rid of, too. Yeah, I I like the... the I Last year, what they did a lot more than the changes they made for this year. Um, if you want my opinion, just Nick's favorite book. Like, it's not... It, it, it's a, it's, it's not that relevant. I know there's a lot of kids out there that like to read, and it's great to encourage kids to read. I was obviously being sarcastic earlier, but um, I don't know. It's just not something that a lot of kids get excited about. I guess, unfortunately. So I would nix that. I mean, I would, I would just nix a lot of this. Just do, you know, cartoons, TV shows, and video games. There was no sports star this year either. No. Which I mean, I don't care about sports, so I'm fine. That's gone. But I, I'm actually surprised there's not like one. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, I would just go with, you know, movie, TV show, cartoon, video game, and then just do a bunch of variations on that. Like, favorite mm -hmm. favorite mobile game and favorite video game, fine. You know, favorite, um, favorite, I, I, again, I would separate, I would say favorite new cartoon, favorite returning cartoon, um, mm -hmm. favorite voice actor, even. I mean, come on, like, seriously, uh, several voice actors are incredibly prolific. I think kids would know who Tom Kenny or Tara Strong is by this point. Oh, yeah. Um, but anyway, there you go. Um, there was nothing, like, incredibly stupid about the choices this year. Um, there was some stuff that's obviously, like, on, on the borderline of being not really for kids, like, you know, the, the, the Ariana Grande song, Bang Bang, um, and the, the family TV shows and stuff. But mm -hmm. otherwise, I mean, I wouldn't say there's anything that was, like, you know, really surprising. Um, but yeah, at the same time, this is kind of disappointing that what they did change. Um, I don't think anything was really changed much for the positive. All right. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, rules out.